Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Geek House. Today in this video, I will quickly show you how you can run GitHub, Node.js and or React.js project on your desktop or laptop. Before we begin, please subscribe to Geek House for future videos on earn money by digital marketing or earning by software development. So let's start. So this is my uh, repo or uh, GitHub repo directory and this project so I will run on my desktop or laptop so let's start if you are a beginner and you never tried this so for that we need to install three software on your desktop computer first one is node.js uh, software which is windows software you have to download and another one is git software and the third is uh, which is Visual Studio Code software three things three softwares you have to download. So let's start one by one So this is uh, the first one that I'm trying to download which is uh, node.js uh, Download you have to go to Google on Google. You have to type node.js uh, Simply on the Google search you have to down, uh, download the node.js uh, Windows installer file And you have to click on the download the first link which says download node.js and then you will see the windows installer and if you are using mac so you can download the mac installer as well so for me this is windows installer so i will use the windows one so i have downloaded already so i'll not do once again so i'll just show you how you can do it so you download it and once it is downloaded you can open this file and on your computer this is windows installer okay go to google.com once again and type visual studio code and once you type there so you will see the download link uh, which would be the second uh, one, second one the first site link of the primary website link click on download and once again you will see the mac version and the windows version and also the ubuntu debian version so you have to choose the windows one since we are I'm using the windows so you, if you have other one you can choose other so since I have already downloaded so I will not download again so I will just open it from my laptop menu and the third one which one is left that is git you have to download the git in order to access the git project on your windows laptop or desktop so go to Google and download the git and click on the download for windows option this one is here if you have the Mac version you can download the Mac one as well so since I am using windows so click on the windows one then you have to download the latest one with the I have 64 bit uh, system machine so I will download the first one which says uh, download click here to download so i'll click here to download it since i have already downloaded so i'll not download it again but you can download and install on your pc or laptop now this is the again uh, repo right directory of git and you have to click on the code button and you have to uh, since this is project uh, one of my clients projects so his more has not said the SSS access but however I do have the HTTPS project code so this is restricted for me which is SSH but I have the HTTPS allowed for me so I'll just copy this link and this link will help me to download all github project to my windows visual studio code project uh, i mean visual studio code program so first open the visual studio code program and uh, but before that you have to create a folder on your desktop where you want to save all the files of your projects so simply 
open up where you want to save the project let's say i just want to save it on my uh, D, i mean the drive which is 22 the folder number 20223 folder number and there is the project the client project and then the project folder here i will uh, go to again the visual studio code and click on file and then open the uh, folder which i have created just now and go to the directory i mean go to the same folder where i created the project folder and click the project YSOC and select folder now this folder is uh, you know in our visual studio code program now we open the terminal you have to here's the important thing comes you have to type the git project here since you want to download the git so remember we did copy the HTTPS URL so you have to type here git clone then paste the url that you copied now it will be cloning the files to your visual studio code now it is successfully done it has copied and cloned the project to my project folder So now you have to come to the package JSON file. In this, you have to uh, you know find out uh, uh, how many components uh, there are there. So you have to install them all of them in order to do that. First, you have to go to the directory where the project is uh, you know led. So it is in under the project folder, which is YCC project. <coughs> and then you have to start like npm node package manager the full form and then clear uh, space start and here you can see the result it's giving some warning because uh, the react uh, components are not installed here so you have to install before that uh, before you know typing the npm start so for that you have to type npm space i and then the component with the ver version make sure you install the exact same version which has installed it in the package json other way you can type npm i it will download and install all the components it will take some time and once it is done you can see it will automatically open up on your browser and sometimes uh, if you are new you may face some problem like your browser will not open or the system the project is not uh, selected the default browser in that case you will face some error or warning so make sure you you know resolve your by copying the error file i mean error uh, you just type on the google and you will find several websites like uh, stackoverflow.com and other, several other websites this website this website will tell you how to resolve this so then again i uh, it is completed now and clicked on npm start so you type the npm start now it is asking to allow the network i did allow it it should be opening in the browser so if you're the first time so since i'm opening this on the machine for the first time so it will take some time now here you can see the file is opening i mean yeah here is a browser opening the port with localhost and in few seconds you will see the web page so yes i can see the project so i hope you learned this uh, from this video you learned how to get the github project on your computer system now you can edit and deploy on the same github project thank you so much for watching this video bye bye